Hello Taurus, welcome to your weekly reading. So Taurus, these messages are timeless. Whenever you click on this video, that is when they could resonate with you the most. Remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click that notification bell in order to receive notifications when I post. If you would like a personal reading or a distance Reiki healing, the information is in the description box below. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. So Spirit, give me some overall energy for Taurus, please. Ooh. Full moon and Gemini, the answers you need are coming. Um, Aries got this same message. You could be a cusp, but yes, whatever it is that you are seeking, you're searching for, you will be getting the answers to it soon. Let's get another energy. At the bottom of the deck, I have luck is on your side and the moon is Sagittarius. So yes, um, I'm hearing luck struck once and now luck strikes twice. So there could be something coming back around towards you, Taurus. I'm also hearing the gospel song, God's on your side. So yeah, whatever it is that you've been going through, um, know that God is carrying you. You're being directed in the right direction. Um, and I'm hearing you're on your right path. So let's go ahead and tap into some more energy. Spirit, give me some more messages for Taurus, please. Messages for Taurus. What would you like for them to know? Messages for Taurus. Oh, okay. So I have the Daughter of Water, which is the Page of Cups in the reverse. Oh, and I have Judgment. Okay, let's get one more message. So for some of you, um, you could have rejected an offer. Or someone could have not made an offer when it came to you. Somebody refused. But with this judgment, whatever it is, like you didn't receive, it was for your highest good. Yeah, Mother of Water, Queen of Cups. Let's clarify. Spirit, give me a message for, okay, God is ready. I have the King of Cups in the reverse. And I have the Seven of Swords. Okay, so somebody um could be dealing with a water sign masculine, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But somebody is emotionally um, unavailable and very manipulative. Um, this person comes with a lot of secrets or came with a lot of secrets. Um, there was also a lot of gossip um, when it came to you or this person, Taurus. I feel like with this temperance and ace of pentacles, um, if you do something online, a lot of people watch you. They watch what you do. For some of you, you could be um, dealing with the Sagittarius. But I feel like um, there's a new opportunity that is coming in for you, something that is divine divinely orchestrated i'm hearing and whatever this opportunity is is definitely going to have people talking because i'm hearing gossip let's clarify tell me about the king of cups in the reverse the king of cups in the reverse for tours please The Four of Cups. Okay, so this person could have rejected you or you rejected this person's offer. For some of you, you could have been dealing with an Aries, the mother of your, the father of your child or children. Um, this person could have went back to someone from their past or you could have went back to someone from your past, Taurus. I feel like you're going to be receiving communication about this. Um, for some of you, you're going to be finding out that um, you were in a third party situation, three of swords. I do see someone um, with this nine of swords being very stressed out, devastated, upset. 
I feel like there was a lot of competition here. Five of Swords. Um, somebody just really wanted to win. Didn't care what they had to do or say to get what they wanted. Let's get a message for the Seven of Swords. Tell me about the Seven of Swords for Taurus, please. Yeah, but somebody could have rejected you in order to go back to someone from their past. Or you could have rejected this person to deal with someone from your past. The Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. So somebody could have been hiding the fact that um, they were needy. They were not financially stable, very codependent. I'm also getting that somebody could have also isolated themselves from you, Taurus. Tell me about this Four of Cups. Four of Cups for Taurus. What is this? Death in Reverse. Scorpio Energy. So somebody um, could have resisted you in order to keep a cycle open with someone else. This person could have possibly been a Scorpio or this could have been a Scorpio masculine. But somebody resisted you in order to keep a cycle open with someone else. Tell me more about the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. So I'm getting that this person or you could have invested into something that really did not give a return. It's like whatever you were pouring, pouring into or this person was pouring into, yeah, like they were getting nothing out of the deal. Somebody was doing all of the work when it came to the connection. Somebody's intentions was to just pretty much be taken care of. And that is what happened in this situation. Somebody's looking at what they invested in, what they gave their time, their energy, their money to. Somebody was just being looked at as a meal ticket. Let's get some messages for judgment. Somebody knew how to manipulate a situation well. I have the Two of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. So your judgment is that you get a brand new beginning. I'm getting things are being made fair. Things are balancing out for you, Taurus. Despite what offer didn't come in for you. Tell me more about the Two of Pentacles. The Three of Cups. Yeah, somebody was juggling. It was a third party situation. But judgment is being called in the situation. Tell me about the Ace of Pentacles. The Six of Cups. So for some of you, this took place in the past with the Six of Cups. I feel like there's an opportunity that is coming back around for you from your past. And this is your justice. This is God calling judgment in your favor. At the bottom of the deck, I have the Knight of Wands and the Devil. Capricorn Energy. So for some of you, you could have been dealing with somebody who was very toxic, low vibrational, very promiscuous, player energy in and out, lack direction, didn't know what they wanted. Yeah, this person wasn't looking for a relationship, the lovers, Gemini energy. This person just wanted to play around, have fun. Tell me more about the Six of Cups. The lovers in the reverse. 
So yeah, there is an opportunity coming back around. Um, in the past, there was a relationship, a connection that did come together or, you know, that didn't work out. But it's like now God is giving you a brand new opportunity. So it's restoration. So whatever you felt like you missed out on, um, you were done wrong in the situation. Um, you were rejected. This person didn't invest in you. Um, this person mistreated you in any kind of way. It's like God is replacing this situation with something better. Justice. Give me some messages for the Three of Cups. Yeah, the Knight of Swords. So... Whatever options this person may have had, it didn't go anywhere. It was just a stalemate. So you didn't miss out on anything, Taurus. And you get something better. Clarifying the Queen of Cups is the Queen of Swords in the reverse. So somebody um is very manipulative with this Queen of Swords. Um, someone can be very harsh with their words, say whatever they want to say, how they want to say it, without any concern for how someone feels. Judgment, the Five of Wands. For some of you, um. You, this person could have had you in competition. But judgment is being called on the situation. I heard competing for you. So you may have people competing for you, Taurus. So just as somebody tried to put you in competition, now you may have people in competition when it comes to you. For some of you with this Knight of Wands in the reverse, again, at the bottom of the deck, it's going to be this person. Now they're going to have to compete for you. So they wanted you to be in competition and compete for them. Now the roles are going to be reversed. They're going to have to compete for you. Again, this is your justice. Let's get another energy for the mother of water. Somebody doesn't like the fact that you're very nurturing. Somebody's very jealous and envious of you, this queen of swords. Somebody has nothing good to say when it comes to you. Tell me more, spirit. <laughs> Justice, Libra energy. Seven of Wands in the reverse, Nine of Swords. Someone feels like they lost. Seven of Wands, Nine of Swords, Nine of Cups in reverse. Somebody feels devastated. Somebody's upset because they lost. Somebody could have been doing um, spell work or manipulating a situation behind the scenes. But it's like with this Ace of Cups in the reverse... This person still didn't get the love offer they wanted. I heard all of that competing for nothing. Tell me about the Queen of Swords in the reverse. Queen of Swords in the reverse for Taurus. The Five of Cups. Oh yeah, this person has nothing good to say about you. 
throw dirt on your name because this person's coming from a hurt place. They're grieving. They're in sorrow. This person is upset. Yeah. Nine of Cups in the reverse. This person is unhappy. They're really unhappy with themselves, but they project. Tell me about justice. Somebody feels like it's not fair that, you know, you are getting what you want or things are working out in your favor. Somebody doesn't like the fact that things are balancing out for you. Two of Wands, you get to move on. You get to level up. For some of you, you're going to be traveling. If you do anything online, you're definitely going to be getting a lot of attention. You get to move on because you chose correctly. You chose right. If you look, it's like she has two choices between the shorter stick or this longer stick. And you chose the longer stick. The one that offered you the more opportunities. The one that offered you the most growth. You chose right. You moved on. You distanced yourself. You rerouted your attention onto something that was going to help you grow. That was going to evolve you. Change your life. So that's why you get justice in this whole situation. Because you didn't remain stuck. You nurtured yourself back to health. Emotionally, mentally, and spiritually. Give me another energy for the Five of Cups. Yep, Seven of Wands. Somebody feels like they lost. Somebody feels at a loss. Somebody feels defeated. Yeah, Three of Swords. Somebody feels hurt. They're heartbroken. They're crying. They're upset. They're in a dark space. Dark clouds. Very gloomy. Tell me about the two of wands. Two of wands for Taurus. Two of wands for Taurus. Okay. The Four of Swords. So somebody is looking at you move on. And somebody's in deep regret. Look at how her hand is over her face. Somebody could also be in jail or going to jail. But I'm here and I can get you out of off my mind. Somebody can't stop thinking about you. Somebody thinks about what happens over and over again. They think about you a lot. Somebody is seeing this as a missed opportunity. Somebody like, I can't believe that I messed this up. That's how somebody feels. Somebody operated out of lust and was naive. Therefore, they chose the past because they was not operating from a place of maturity. Somebody was very free spirited. They liked to do whatever they wanted to do, whatever felt good for the moment. So let's get you some final messages. Spirit, give me some final messages for Taurus. A final message for Taurus. Yes, luck is on your side. Everything is tipping in your favor. What do I have? I am perceptive. So yes, looking deeper. I feel like because you were able to see this whole situation from a higher perspective, that's why you were able to move on. Instead of being in this five of cups, you ended up in this two of wands energy. 
because you seen things for what it was. You saw the spider webs and you moved away. So Taurus, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Also, Spirit is saying for a lot of you, you're very intuitive as well, Queen of Cups. So it's like you paid attention to your intuition. You let your guides lead you out of the situation. So that's why things are turning in your favor. So again, stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.